All right, our next performer. Is, uh, I will avoid the obvious pun, so I'm just going to announce Mr. Tony Bates. Any beer drinkers here tonight? Okay, okay, I'll speak slowly. Uh, Vermont beer names are a little bit funky. We've got some pretty cutesy microbrew beer names. You can go downtown and get a bottle of double bag with the udder on it, glass of switchback, pint of hibernator, stovepipe porter, dog bite bitter. For Christmas, somebody gave me a case of smutty nose. A case of smutty nose. That's not like getting beer, that's like getting a venereal disease on my face. <laughs> not something I'd want to re-gift to my sister. <laughs> uh, but I'm from Vermont, I understand that the beer names are weird. But I thought, wouldn't it be possible for a bored bartender on a slow day to goof on a tourist? Change the names on the specials board to something really absurd just to see what he'd buy? What can I get for you boys? Uh, we'll need uh, four pints, please. Uh, Phil will take a Lake Champlain Perch Seaman Pilsner. Uh, Gary will take a King Street Whore Taint Lager, please. So in Vermont, you put the... Okay, when in Rome, Gary. Uh, quick question. Your long trail scrotal hernia pale, is that... Is that hoppy? And I will take a Fletcher Allen and I'm a bag brown ale, please. <laughs> We're gonna pass on the menus. Pretentious people bother me. Uh, like it or not, in Vermont, we have some people who think they're just a little bit better than the rest of us. And they all reside in the same geographical area. They're all in the upper right corner of the state, Caledonia, Essex, Orleans counties. Up right near Canada, what's that called? The Kingdom, thank you, Andrew Knox. <laughs> They'll tell you they're from the kingdom. They don't mind telling you that either. Where are you from, Guildhall? Guildhall, where's that? Oh, it's, uh, it's in the kingdom. <laughs> they think there's a kingdom up there. <laughs> so when they say that to me, I go like this. <laughs> You're from the kingdom? Is the moat deep? <laughs> Is the queen bosomy? How's Gandalf's prostate? Is he getting the surgery or are they going to implant the wands? The only reason they call it the kingdom is because a guy named George Aiken, who was our U.S. Senator and Governor back in the 30s and 40s, coined the term and used it in a speech once, whereupon a desperate used car dealer from frickin' Newport jumped on the phrase like it was the last chopper out of Nam. He had a meeting in the back of the showroom. All right, guys, listen up. We are dying. We need a brand. Because I am tired of starving in this godforsaken inbred shithole we got here. So from now on, no matter what podunk town you're from, don't say it. You're from the kingdom. The kingdom, got it? I mean, Oliver, what would you rather say? Call me Sire, I'm from the kingdom, or call me Sal, I'm from Derby Line? <laughs> Martha, what town are you from? Lemington? Lemington. A town so small there aren't even enough people there to stop someone from calling it Lemington. <laughs> Peter, where are you from? How you from Holland? Holland, Vermont? That's a ridiculous name. There aren't even any dikes there. <laughs> Am I talking too fast, sir? Okay, I've only got five minutes. You people either need to stop drinking or start drinking a lot more. We're dicking around. I understand the bartender's offering a wonderful hemorrhoid harvest ale. In the back. It's the special. My name is Tony Bates. That's my time. Thank you very much.